Namaste guys, in this video we are going to learn how to make this bending effect in DaVinci. So let's start. First I will go to my edit mode. Right click, click on new fusion composition. You can change the frame rate as per your requirement. Click on create. Now drag this and drop it here. Now click on fusion. So first thing that I want is a shape that basically I want to bend. So I will go to the tools and go downwards, look for shape and I will select rectangle and I will also select as render because without it I can't you know join this media out. So first attach with this one and then this thing. Notice it's here. Now I will select as render sorry rectangle and increase it width to 1 and decrease its height in order to your requirement how much height you want to decrease. I think this much is fine and let's move a little bit downwards. Okay. Now how can I bend it? That's the main question. So if I press shift plus space bar and search for bend notice that there is a bender option but it's in 3d so let's try out so what i will do i will go to 3d uh, okay. image plane 3d okay and i also need a render uh, so i will press shift space and type render look for 3d render okay this one and press shift space type bend render add now drag this to here and drag this bender 3d to media out now it is not bending it's still like this thing so what i have to do is click on this bender 3d what i want i want to bend so if I increase this value, it doesn't look like it's bent. Change the axis. Now it looks like it's bending. If I make it one, it's bent. But why they are sharp edges? So if you are familiar with the 3D software, then you know that it lacks number of subdivisions. So what I have to do is I will select the image in 3D, increase the number of subdivision to let's say 32 is fine. 32 is the standard. That normally I take for you know my blender software. So notice this is how it looks like. So we have bent the shape. So now you can you know do the animation as per your requirement. You can make the same scale. It's up to you, spaceship and run 3D. Let's now do the animation. So to do the animation is quite simple. Let's make it zero first. Let's go to the first frame. Click on this. Let's click on 60th frame. Make it one. One means 360 degree. Okay. So if I go here and click on play, notice it's working. So in that way you can make it. Now some question comes to mind. Uh, hey, suppose I want to increase the, you know, the diameter of the circle. So what should I supposed to do? So go to the S rectangle and not S offset. Increase this Y offset value and and make this X offset zero. Okay. So with that you can control it okay how much or big and you can choose any other shape as per your requirement and not only you can bend you can also do taper and taper thing notice and this is uh, is downwards because of our y offset so if i move upward so you can see so in that way you can create custom animation as per your requirement okay i hope you guys learned something from this video 
if you have any kind of doubts and queries feel free to ask thanks for watching and have a great day namaste